Welcome back to the channel. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button. Also, please hit the notification bell. I do drop new content on this channel every single day. So with that being said, let's just get right into the video. It is Monday, May 17th, and I want to talk about Hummingbird Finance, HMNG, up 25% on the day, you guys, to 0.000001 at the time of this video, okay? So like I said, up 25%. And if we take here a look at the all-time chart here for Hummingbird Finance was listed back last week, Wednesday, May 12th. So really been trading for about five days now and really been one of the top is actually in the top 10 of most viewed cryptocurrencies on CoinMarketCap. It is sitting currently at number 10 ahead of Binance Coin, ahead of VeChain, ahead of Happy Coin, Chia Network Solana, Aquago Finance, Bonfire, other coins, Stellar, Alaska Inu, even Feg Token is down in Do Dogalon Mars as well. But you can see your Hummingbird Finance number 10 on the most viewed cryptocurrencies on coin market cap. So definitely a coin of interest for a lot of people. And going back to this, you can see here it did hit an all-time high on Sunday. Kind of been up and down since, but starting to creep back up today. Um, up, like I said, up 25%. So I just wanted to make this video to go over Hummingbird Finance, what the token and what the project really does, and just give my overall updated opinion or my overall opinion on Hummingbird Finance. So Let's just get right into it, you guys. Hummingbird Finance. You can see here a benevolent, a benevolent goal. If you are if you are in harmony with our desire to protect hummingbirds, we welcome your support. Hummingbird Finance contract is designed to apply three percent tax to every transaction. One and a half is distributed to the current holders, and one and a half is burned forever, which decreases the supply of HMNG. Auto staking holders earn passive rewards through static reflection as they watch their balance of HMNG grow indefinitely. Now you can see here they talk about hummingbirds and how hummingbirds are native to the Americas and constitute a biological family, Trochilidae. There are about 360 species. And they're talking here, you can go ahead and donate to the American Bird Conservancy to protect hummingbirds. I'm sure a lot of you, everyone watching this video knows what a hummingbird is. Tokenomics, the daily statistics, 66,000 holders currently. Um, that's up quite a bit from when I first ever looked at their website, up about 30,000 holders. So like I said, a lot of people currently looking at Hummingbird Finance as a potential buy. And you can see here, like I said, 5% tax, 3% tax on every transaction, similar to a lot of these other cryptocurrencies that are doing this sort of tax on the sellers to reward the holders. So nothing new there. Um, if you take a look at their roadmap, however, something that I always like to do when looking at a new token is make sure you guys are diligently looking at the roadmap, see where they've, see where they're, how far they've come and where they plan to go. So when doing that here for Hummingbird Finance, you can see they launched on PancakeSwap April 2021. So just last month, marketing campaign and audit was done, coin market cap listing. CoinGecko listing, farmings, MF NFTs, partnerships with Hummingbird Charities, donation, light paper release, partnerships with their projects, exchange listings. And then in, coming up next month, they have, they're going to have an AMA, which is always very crucial. Development team expansion, Hummingbird Finance app, more languages on the website, marketing for Asian marketplaces, and then listing on top tier exchanges. And I mean, obviously, that's the uh, the big catalyst, right, for all these coins and all these tokens that are just, you know, very, very cheap, right? Either running on the, running on Ethereum or running on Binance Smart Chain is the end goal or the ultimate goal to, you know, be listed on one of the top tier exchanges. And, you know, it's currently on CoinGecko, Vindax, BankCX. I mean, there's so many exchanges now that, you know, there's the top tier ones. And if you do get listed on the top tier ones, it's obviously great for your cryptocurrency and great for the value of the coin if you are a holder but obviously that is the catalyst and something that a lot of these tokens are looking for so it makes sense that that is on their roadmap heading into quarter four of this year so if you do take a look here at their twitter um pretty legit twitter i'd say they do they do are they do seem pretty active on the twitter right and that's what you look for you want to make sure that they're active and continuing to update their holders on what's kind of going on here with hummingbird finance um, you know, similar process to buying Hummingbird Finance on the Pancake Swap, getting a trust wallet, MetaMask, things like that. Same sort of process. I'm not going to dive into it. But today they did reach 10,000 followers on Twitter. So that is something of note to definitely be aware of. You know, see 
how many followers they have and how fastly or how fast their Twitter followers are growing as well. And even they, they announced that, you know, at 11 hours ago, they have already at 10.6. So, you know, continuing to grow at a sub, sub, I would say, average rate currently on Hummingbird Finance. And again, we had paid marketing since the launch. We continue to do so. We Today, we have famous YouTuber talking about HMNG. And exchange listing the partnerships are on the roadmap already being discussed. We'll announce more details in the near future. So this is also something... Um, that I wanted to mention that I haven't mentioned in any previous video is that there's a lot of the, um, these new tokens and cryptocurrencies where they reach out to YouTubers, you know, to talk about the coin cryptocurrency and um, it's obviously paid marketing. So that doesn't necessarily like for, and I, I will always dis uh, disclose that information if, you know, I ever am talking about a cryptocurrency that I was paid to market and I've yet to do one. But I wanted to ask you guys if you guys that's something you guys would be interested in me doing because I have been offered, um, you know, paid advertisement for cryptocurrencies. But again, I want to stay true to my roots here and really just talk about cryptocurrencies that I find um, legitimate and definitely ones that I think can be beneficial to my subscribers or just the information can be beneficial to my subscribers. So let me know in the comments below on that one. But back to Hummingbird Finance, you guys. Again, top 10 most viewed cryptocurrencies on coin market cap. I think we're going to see this starting to climb back up, up another 3% since the start of this video. So she, you can see here slowly starting to climb back up from the all-time high we did see back on Sunday. So again, a lot of buying pressure here for HMNG. Let me know in the comments how you guys feel about Hummingbird Finance. If you guys have any Hummingbird Finance, let me know. Hit that subscribe button, hit the notification bell, drop a like on this video, and as always, have a great day.